Hey guys, I figured I'd give you a bonus game. So here we are in my M18 Hellcat. Yes, that is Bond equipment on my M18 Hellcat. Don't ask. Not my Super Hellcat, my M18 Hellcat. Are you thinking, why? Because my M18 Hellcat is um, one of my favorite low tier uh, tank destroyers. Uh, it was the Jackson, it was the Slugger. Um, and um, I mean it for, for the longest time it was the slugger in fact I believe I, the slugger was the first of the American tank destroyers that I actually got a mastery excuse me mastery badge in my morning coffee is fighting me Woo. Um, and so yeah I got a mastery badge in uh, in that and that fueled me to be a better That fueled me to just be a better um, a tank, a, a tank, just tank player. That, that just a better player all around. Okay, so the KV one is. Wow, that is one of the luckiest fucking M5 Stewarts I've ever seen in my life. Of course, of course, yes, of course. Yeah. Luck only gets you so far, mate. Is that Panzer 2J? Oh, Panzer 3J. Wow. Oh, of course. Their buildings are indestructible. We get bushes. Now, a lot of people keep asking me, why do I like um, the Hellcat over other, um, over the Slugger, case in point. Mostly because the Hellcat has speed. I mean, take a look, the enemy is vehemently pushing into the base. So, I have to defend it. I have to, which means I'm going to use what camo I can, where I can. Okay, so we tracked him. It's fine. What the hell? Good defense. Okay, let's switch back to our regular AP rounds. Track him. Good, good, good. Yeah, of course, you're going to shoot me on the fly and pen me. British Cavalier. Oh, of course. Nothing I could do, mate. Did what I could, brother. But, you know, two kills. Me and the Cromwell B literally carried that entire team. And so, it, it, it happens, guys. You're going to come across teams that are just... That's all I can say. <laughs> just, just no words. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the bonus game. Back to the on track. And we are back. We're on Westfield. It's an encounter. Tier 9. Yay. 
<laughs> Sorry, I'm not a fan of tier 9s. But what I am going to do is they do have quite a lot of tank destroyers. Hmm. We do have a couple... We have a tanky heavy, which is the Type 4. They've got an AMX M54... Uh, uh, M451, sorry. In a platoon with an object 430U and a UDES 16. Hmm. Of course, we've got three of our biggest tanks have droopy barrel syndrome. Cool. So, that doesn't exactly bode well. T92 is doing what T92s do best, which is drive forward, light everyone up, then die, then complain. One on one team! Because you, moron, quite literally went ahead faster than anyone. Okay, so there's two on the cap. It's fine. Uh, I believe there is indestructible buildings on the cap, unfortunately. And that's fine. It is what it is. That's nice. Yep, T92 is doing what T92 is do best. Like I said. Sure would be nice if someone got into that cap. Thank you. Of course it's a scorpion. It's always a fucking scorpion. Can I fed one in? Okay. Fuck off T92, you piece of shit. Wow. Shell deviation on that, bro. Thank you. Thank you. That's what I like to see. I legit just watched my shelf fucking move mid-flight. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? How is this T92 lighting me up like Christmas? For real. The only problem with this tank is it has no view range. Yeah, so he's he's running because he's a coward. Thank you, Swo. Like for real, I'm looking right there, and he just poof disappears on me.
Nothing I can do. Yep. Again, apparently something's lighting me up. So you're telling me that this Suo's got a better view range than I do. You can fuck off. Fuck off too. No, drop dead. Fuck off, leave me alone. Right, now my radio is proper fucked. Nice shot, Suo. Burn you motherfucker. Burn. Good goddamn. Good grief, like for real. So it's an object. Two. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Of course. Got them out, you. Literally watching my shell deviate mid flight. GG morons! Waffle Tracker did fuck all. Two Yag Tiger and whatnot did fuck all. I'm sorry, but no. How that fucking T90, that T92 managed to light me up that fucking far away is beyond me, just blows my fucking mind. <sighs> well, that was a loss. And we even lost 30,000 credits, so what in new? Because, you know, nice fun board gaming. On to the next. Right, we are on Mountain Pass, Standard Battle. Hmm, let's see, what are we going to do? It's tier 8. So, that should be better for us. Um, no, mm, you know what, yeah, I think I'll, I'll protect the bridge. The things I do for you guys, I mean, the fact that I am literally grinding out a nation that I can't stand just so I can get a tank destroyer and a medium tank. Uh, the, th the things I do for you guys. Right, so their Progetto 46 has been lit. Wow, it's a big middle push. Okay, interesting, interesting. Yeah, see, Wargaming wouldn't know how to modify a map and make it friendly f for love nor money. The bear in mind, I've got no view range. Okay, so there's a super push. Hello. What's up, dude? Okay. Can I push him off? No. 
Okay, that's fine. What's up, dude? How you doing? What's up? How you doing? He doesn't know where to pen me. Of course. Got a module. Right in the cheek. He really does not know. Got him again. Thank you, Scorp. Wow, really, bro? Okay. Dear, 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 dear. Oh, of course, EPR fucking shoots me once and sets me on fire. <laughs> it's all good. I <laughs> just made an one want to quit. Messed up the super purge. We've got a great big ice road push. It's fine. As long as the central hold, middle holds, we've got this. <laughs> Looks like a win. <laughs> Sorry, that was hilarious. Sometimes this take control. Especially on like super purging where they just don't know where to aim. They're like... <laughs> and even the Emil was trying to shoot me in the sides. Boom. Will you leave off, you French twat? Dong. Let me fuck this guy up, then you're next. <laughs> you could see him backing up like, ah, 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 ah. Angry Russian! Angry Russian! <laughs> anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give the video a like. I greatly appreciate it. Leave a comment for the algorithm. If you're new around here, hit the subscribe button. Again, big thank you to coffeebrandcoffee.com for sponsoring this whole entire video series. Guys, please check them out. Links will be in the video description. Uh, again, guys, <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Can't make this up.